hello guys welcome back to this course to learn flutter application development in the previous video we did all these things as you can see on the screen we have created the text field to get the user or advertiser name phone number and model number of products color description everything so now let's uh, continue this uh, design and let's make functionality more functionality in this page so today we will remove this toast message later not now let's see uh, see carefully step by step what actually i will do here so here after this is this is the single scroll view here you will this is the here so it's a if condition here so we will write now else condition so here come here and after this remove this comma and put uh, else if else and here we will return stack stack widget inside this stack visit first of all let's add here after this container size box size height will be 30 and comma and now here inside this stack we will say child children i mean and children will be children container inside this container child padding inside this padding padding edge inset dot all and let's give to four and after this then child will be grid view we will show our email which we will select from phone gallery in grid view so grid view dot builder and this builder provides us some properties here as you can see here grid delegates and uh, item count builder item counter so remove this and right here silver silver grid delegated with fixed cross axis account this one and after this and cross accounts will be three comma then after this here item count will be five sorry not five remove this item count will be underscore image dot length plus one comma like this and remove this item builder and here put two columns context comma index put two curly braces here and here return index return index return index is equal to equals to equal to zero remove this and write if condition center visit inside the center visit child icon button inside this icon button we have icon and icons icons dot add this one and on press will be like this remove this bracket here like this remove this and directly like this 
and we'll be uploading we will provide here function for choose image choose image choose image and brackets else null like this and here this we have closing this now then here else condition else container and inside this margin edge inset edge inset edge inserts dot all three and after the decoration box decoration image decoration image inside this decoration image we will pass image and then image file 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 image file image and then underscore image this is our variable underscore image this one and then index minus one and click on it it's showing error click on it and you will see here this error bulb click add null check like this and still it's showing error what's the error so first of all let's create this function here this this one click click this uh, sorry copy this and come here in the down and here paste it make it a sync open brackets and here write final picked file equals to await picker picker dot pick image pick pick image and image source image source dot gallery we are accessing our phone gallery and put semicolon and here set state underscore image dot add file add file then file picked file this one pick the file and then remove this dot path like this and click on it and you will see this red bulb here and here just uh, remove this right again image image dot add and file this one's one and then 
and here we will pass picked file variable dot path and remove this click on it and here add this exclamation and after this write here if if picked file if picked file dot path is equal to show null then what we have to do here and put here exclamation like this and inside this and here remove this two curly brackets and right here retrieve retrieve lost data this is a function retrieve like this and let's create this function also put here semicolon like this so copy this come here and here right here future void and this function and inside this and async add async here like this its spelling is r i e v e retrieve lost like this and just copy this paste above same spelling like this inside this final lost data response lost data response is equal to response await picker picker dot retrieve lost data like this and give one condition here if response this one this variable is response is empty so we will return return like this and then one more else can if condition so like this and here if if response response dot file is not equals to null sorry is not equals to null what we are going to do we will set a state here set a state response dot add sorry not response image dot add file file and file file response dot file not file response dot file dot path 
and put semicolon here like this and here also exclamation what's the error let's make it first here else condition else print response dot file dot file like this now for removing this error what we have to do these are the two errors here and now to remove these two errors here we have to change something above come here instead of this uh, import dot dot html import dot dot io import dot io this one io and you will see this error has gone now we have two error here so click on it and let's add a null check here like this and one more things we have one error more here put here semicolon like this so all error has gone now so after this So now come above here. We were here before. So we have uh, created our this choose image function below. Now we will work on it again. So here, comma and say fit box fit box fit will be cover dot cover like this. And then after this. And now after this uh, container here, we will say uploading variable, uploading if true. So what we are going to do, so we will say center, center and inside the center child column main exercise main exercise dot min dot min and after that put here this semicolon here or this put like comma put here comma so that error will go so after this here children container inside this container child text con child text and text will be uploading text will be like this uploading 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 after this let's give some style to this text style text style font size will be 20 and then after this after this container let's give one size box size box height will be 12 and then after this we will say here circular in progress indicator inside this value will be well and then and value color will be always stop animation always always stop animation and here put color and then this colors dot green like this then after this and after this center 
we will say else container like this that's all so what actually we did here guys let me tell you and explain you in the previous video we have uh, written this if next is true so we are showing this text and please select image all these things and we are on press we are setting these images dot length 5 if the user has chosen 5 images we are going to upload images on application or else we will provide error here error you can write error like this then here we are we are showing all these text field where the user will or advertiser will fill every your information phone number modern number product name etc now we have given this after this in this video from here we have start so we have given this size box after that we have given this stack visit in, in inside this stack visit we have given this container and we are showing our image in grid view like uh, grid so and grid will be 3 so in one row 3 image will be display then item count will be plus 1 so when we select one image so it will add like uh, we select one image then again one image then again so it will be plus so then we are returning index equal to 0 and if it's true we may return the center visit and center visit icon this add icon this and uploading is true so we are going to choose image from gallery and we have created this function here this is choose image to access our phone gallery and then we are uh, else we are returning container and we set this image in index minus one so then after this if uploading is true we are returning center column and uploading text and then here circular progress indicator and this is the color of this and we are in container again and this is your function for retrieval of data so guys uh, we have to remove this first so let's comment this comment like this and then come above and here we have this toast remove this because the null safety don't uh, support this now and we have to import one here import path path or dot as path like this okay and make sure change this dot io not html so let's test the application it's working or not so let's click on this icon so now guys we are here and let's click on this uh, floating action button and now you can see we have this text please select images and next which is here this one we have given here condition so here condition is false because still we did not choose any image so it's showing us please select images this one when we have selected when we will have selected the images so it will show us please write product information so let's select images here click on this icon here plus let's select five images one two three four and five and just click now click on this next button so now this condition will be true this one it will be true because we have selected these five images here you can say length five so we have selected five images so now condition will be true so let's click on next and you can see here we have all these text fields and please write in product information this one because the condition is true so we are showing this text here so now as you can see all these text field where is it here you can see these the product cost product phone sorry enter your phone here all these text fields are here which we have created here all these description here description now if i click on this upload it will show a dialog box now you can see it's working fine so see you guys in the next video we will do all functionality in this application bye bye